Hello everybody, my name is Omar Taba. I'm Vice President of Products and Solutions at Brainbox and happy to be with you today and talk about some uh, common questions that uh, everyone has. We have interfaced with and optimized uh, all of the major types of mechanical equipment uh, and HVAC equipment out there. So HVAC systems like chillers, boilers, uh, rooftop units, air handlers of various types, uh, fan coil units, heat pumps, um, VRF systems, VAVs. So we have uh, quite a bit of experience uh, in that arena. And as it relates to uh, control systems, uh, we also interface with all of the major brands of control systems out there on the market. really is an optimization of an existing uh, building's uh, automation and controls system. So that means we need access to data. So this is sensory data like temperature, humidity. It's also actuator data like a fan status or a cooling status. We need to be able to read, so monitor what's happening in the building. And we also need to be able to, after having analyzed and uh, trained the AI, to write back to the building. So this read-write capability um, is accomplished by interfacing to the BMS, the building management system, using uh, BACnet, Modbus, or Niagara protocols in the field. Uh, we also have native Niagara drivers that can be installed on uh, Niagara installations. We also have uh, cloud APIs that we leverage if the data is already in the cloud. So we've done um, projects on small box retail buildings where it's a you know, five to 10,000 square foot uh, retail outlet with two or three rooftop units, uh, single zone rooftops, and we were able to optimize and reduce their energy consumption by over 20%. And we've also done you know, million square foot uh, commercial office high rise buildings and kind of everything in between. So the technology does scale well and uh, we have different applications that obviously target the different use cases and the different types of occupants that these buildings would have. Uh, well, thanks for your time today. I hope this was helpful. If you have any uh, comments, please leave them in the comment section below and we look forward to hearing from you. Have a great day.